there are two things I want to do. One is Gap VMS, which is the inventory management system, open source, yada yada. And the other one is the uh, DIY home automation. And in my case, I'm using the Modbus and Arduino and some very uh, custom uh, holding module thing that I haven't given it a proper name yet. However, I did design it in Tinkercad, and since I got the new 3D printer, the Mingda Magician Max, I need to do some designing, and this time in FreeCAD. So I'm replicating this part, and the new thing for me will be that there are other parts that interlock with it. I might link um, a little link for you up there uh, because I think I showcased it before but designed using Tinkercad so this part I'm trying to uh, redesign now the biggest pain was the, the um, dimensions so that took me uh, quite a bit of time to get you know the millimeters and angles and all that fun stuff and now I'm getting the bit where the other module slid in um, so that shouldn't be too difficult. I should be pocketing this. And let's think the design over there allows for a few millimeters at the bottom for the other item to oh, come over here to the end. So let's go to three four millimeters should be enough no one will be fighting with this device at all or well, this holder so that should be absolutely fine uh, to just reiterate it's this part right here because when you slit the entire module it has to rest on something so that's the, the bit and i also need this cut out which i actually did measure out so let's say I'm happy with this. Okay, coolio. So there's that, amazing. That looks good. And now cut this sucker out. So I need the full cut finger. And I'll need to pocket that. And I think I need to uh, go through all. I don't think there'll be anything behind the uh, nope. Not really, no. So yeah, this looks really good. Why oh, this is running away from me today. <laughs> uh, late in the evening. Okay, yeah, that looks really promising. Now obviously extra few holes and cutouts here and here and the biggest challenge will be how to design in one plane, two, not plane, one of these, I uh, keep forgetting how they are called, how to design the other part uh, so that I made sure it's gonna fit. Because with this one, I could literally just align them and cut them out using the, uh, what you call it, subtraction, grouping, whatever it was called in Tinkercad. Now in uh, FreeCAD, I'll have to figure out how to do that some YouTube tutorials ahead of me, uh, but first I'll get all of the uh, all of the important bits and bobs uh, saw out and get them first cuts and then do the rest. Okay, that's it. I'm just rambling. Just letting you know, I'm also working on that as a little side hustle. And uh, yeah, have a good one. Thanks for watching. I'll just save that before I go. Cheers.